Oh yeah. What's good, YouTube? Welcome back to some more Pokemon Gold. It's been a minute since we've recorded this series. Uh, in the last episode, you guys, we did take on the first gym of the Johto region against Faulkner himself. We were a little bit overleveled, a little bit more overleveled than I thought. So, needless to say, it was a pretty solid battle. Uh, after that, we went to the Ruins of Alf to check out and see what was going on, encountered some unknown, but didn't really need to feel the need to catch any right now. And we are progressing our way down. I don't recall... What is this route? Hold on. I don't think it shows. Hold on. Here we go. Right here. Route 32. Wait. Okay. But yes. Progressing down Route 38. Sorry. Uh, but if you guys are hyped and excited for today's episode, like, comment, and subscribe. And as always, let's get in a quick team recap. So, up first, our only team member right now still is Stump the Bayleaf, who actually evolved in the last episode, from what I remember. Uh, he is a level 16, holding the Miracle Seed. We gave him the Miracle Seed last episode. Uh, that guy right that's right next to us gave it to us. But we are rocking Tackle, Poison Powder, Razor Leaf, and Reflect. And we have this egg, and we don't know what's in it. Oh, whoops. But let us make our way down the route and see who or what we have in stores for us here. Just Rattata. Never mind. Never mind. Fuck you, Rattata. Get out of here, you wizard. I haven't seen you around before. So you think you're pretty tough? I also I just remembered it too. I you know I've, I kept complaining about how the text seems super slow to me, and because I fucked up, you guys. When we first started this playthrough, I accidentally put it on slow instead of fast. So after this battle, I'm going to change the shit out of that, because I just remember that, and it still pisses me off to this day. I also want to uh, mention to you guys, I do have a team planned out for this playthrough. Basically, there's some Pokemon in here that I haven't used before in a playthrough, and I'd really like to. Uh, the only reason I haven't used them before is because they are a little bit weird to use. They have they have gimmicks. They're gimmicky Pokemon. And you don't see them around too often. But... They are... The problem is some of them are going to be in later... Uh, later parts of our game. Which is okay. I mean... Just depending on how, how smooth, the, smooth sailing our playthrough goes... Uh, things should be super solid. Look, watch this. See? It's on slow. It's because I'm so used to going to the right to pick the... the thing. There we go. There we go. See? Now he's talking fast. There we go. Life is better again. But let's keep making our way down. No, Mr. Rattata. We don't need to talk to you. And now that I actually remember that we have a, uh, a speed-up button, every time we encounter a Pokemon, I can just fucking fly through it real quick. Pardon? A battle? I'm on the phone. Oh, alright, but make it fast. Don't tell me what to do. Picnicker Liz wants to battle with her Nidoran. <clears throat> See, I'm just scared that before the second gym, we're going to be level 30. <laughs> I really don't want to be level 30 before the first gym, or the second gym. But, eh, no, I'll save that for later. I'm not going to spoil you guys yet. No, 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 no. Oh, that was it. Alright, Liz. Take it easy. That's mean. You're mean. Was he? Want to give me your phone number? Getting chicks numbers, bro. Call me if something comes up. Hey, will do. Uh, I want to go down this way. Easy XP. <clears throat> My Pokemon? Freshly caught. See, the only problem right now is because some of the 
uh, members of our team we don't get until later in the game it's gonna be super awkward just this early like portion of the game because we'll only have like I don't know not only half our team before we actually get to <clears throat> I think until like the fourth or fifth gym or something like that But, uh, I don't know. Depending on how it goes, I might change up the team a little bit. While still trying to use Pokemon that I don't use often. <clears throat> splash? No. I'm not Young Gravy. I don't Splash. Whoa. He made me lose that fish. I think I'm going to try and make you lose some weight, too. But, hey. It's okay. It's okay, my guy. I'm a little bit on the heavy side. A little bit. I think last time I scaled myself, I finally hit 200. <laughs> but just because I hit 200 doesn't mean it's all muscle. <laughs> For those of you who don't know, or are new to the channel here, uh, I am quite the glutton. I do love to eat a lot. And you know, actually, speaking of that, my, uh, my mom had made dinner... I don't know, like three or four days ago. She made pasta, right? It's cool and all, right? right? Just regular pasta with meat sauce. I don't know what she did differently, okay? But that shit was bussin'. I had, oh man, I think between when she first made it and yes, as of yesterday, I had about, I don't know, five or six bowls. It was, this shit was so good, dude. Cause that's the thing so people every time i go to parties or a friend's house or significant others right they tell me uh eat as much as you want have as much as you like to have now every time people tell me this and i do have as much as i want and eat as much as i like i get yelled at for it because i eat too much because that happened with my mom she was like bro I was excited to have a nice fat bowl of pasta right after work, and there's no more fucking pasta. <laughs> so when people tell me, please have as much as you like, I hesitate. I hesitate, and a lot of the time I'll purposely eat a little bit less than I should. Just for the sake of not getting yelled at by people. Oh, what the hell? Uh, uh, what the hell? A phone call? Hi Solus, how are you? I found a useful item shopping, so I bought it with your money. Sorry. It's in your PC, you'll like it. Alright. <laughs> Thanks, Mom. Appreciate you. My hard-earned money. We're actually gonna go up here first. So we can grab some items, and I think there's... I think it's just this guy? I think it's just this guy here. Bellsprout, fuck you. Rattata, fuck you. Yeah, okay. It's just this guy. That glance. It's intriguing. Oh, yeah? Is my glance intriguing, buddy? Mr. Camper Roland? With a Nidoran male? You know, I think I mentioned before, uh, when Pokemon Gold and Silver first came out, they introduced gender. Technically, I was right. But at the same time, there's also Nidoran male and female, which have been in the game forever. And they were distinguished differently right at the start with their male and female symbols. Oh, hello. I found some good Pokemon in the grass. I think they'll do it for me. Oh, yeah? Oh, yeah. Mr. Youngster Gordon with a whooper. <gasps> Look at that face. There is no there is not a single thought going in that head of his. He's just he's just there. He's he he's enjoying himself. Hmm. Darn, I thought I could win. You could have. You didn't use a fucking 
Oh. How would you like to have this tasty, nutritious slowpoke tail? For you right now, just one million dollars. You want this? No. Buddy, you interrupted me. You came- you went out of your way to bother me. So don't go acting up. Shall we heal your Pokemon for you? Yes, please. Thank you for waiting. Alright. And pretty soon here, we're gonna be heading into a cave, which I don't know... Oh, I would like to have a rod. Wow. Thank you. Okay. What should I make my Pokemon hold? Maybe an item that increases attack power? Hmm. Maybe. Okay. And I'll be right back, you guys. There's something I need to check out real fast, and I'll explain shortly after. Alright. So, the reason I had to do that was because, since we had the old rod, I needed to check out and see if we can actually get our... One of our other team members, uh, specifically in the ruins of Alf, is kind of like their main location. But I didn't know if I had to surf for them or if I had to fish, and it turns out we had to uh, surf. So unfortunately, we don't get our newest team member, one of our newest team members, just yet. But hopefully, shortly, sometime soon, we are about to hit level 18, which is kind of crazy. Alright. Mr. Spiro, hello. We almost one shot, that's cool. I'm amazed we don't one shot half of these things yet. I mean, we are only 10 levels above, I guess. And it is Bayleaf, who doesn't really have the highest, like, attack power. Uh, but I mean, yeah, I mean, yeah, I mean, I know what my weaknesses are. Oh yeah, do ya? Tell me, tell me, tell me in full detail. All right, and with that, we're here in the dark cave. It's times like this where I wish I had um, repels. Hopefully, we don't encounter too many Zubits. Oh, what a surprise! I didn't expect to see anyone here. Oh, guess what? <laughs> I'm here. Bum, bum, bum. Oh, goodness gracious. It's an onyx. <gasps> no. We missed Fraser Leaf. It's over. We're dead. We're doomed. Oh, yeah. And so I know if the lighting seems a little bit darker than normal, I do apologize for that to you guys. My usual desk lamp bulb went out for some reason the other night. Uh, I wanted to record some Minecraft, and the light was kind of shitty. So for right now, I kind of just have to deal with it. So if you see that in future episodes, for the time being, that would be why. Which, trust me, I don't, I don't get it either. But hey. I tried, I mean, I guess I've had that lamp forever. I've had it for quite a while. But I mean, still, come on. <laughs> come on. Come, come on. <laughs> but anyway, we are here fighting this hiker with his fucking, his Geodude army, apparently. Alright. Geodude, fuck off. Get out of here. No, we're level 19. Stop. No. Zubat Supersonic keeps confusing my Pokemon. I'm seriously upset about that. Oh, yeah? I'm sorry. Mr. Fire Breather Bill. <gasps> With a coughing. Oh, no. Lord have mercy. Okay. Solid damage. A coughing misses. It doesn't get better than that. I mean, as long as he doesn't poison gas me, I'm pretty okay with that. Oh, he has another one. Hey there, Mr. Coughing. Please don't hurt me. 
Can you imagine if that one missed too? That would be kind of funny. Just fire breather Bill and his two big balls. Yay! I flamed out. Flamed out? Whatever. I was gonna say, wouldn't that make more sense to say burned out? But what do I know? Found an X attack, Pog. I need to stop tabbing so much. I need to stop it, but I, it's a force of habit. I roam far and wide in search of Pokemon. Are you looking for Pokemon too? Then you're co you're my collecting rival. Uh, sure. <laughs> sure, we'll say that. With your slow poke. Slow poke. Hit him up with a fatty razor leaf. For the easy pickings with a critical hit. Honestly, it doesn't get much better than that. Ugh, my poor Pokemon. Wee. Oh yeah, we need to check that. Uh, we need to check what mom bought us. Stop it. TM39. I don't recall what TM39 is. What is that? It's Swift. Okay. I guess that's cool. X defend, poopy. I always I always sell the X items. There's really no point in having them, to be completely honest. Find an awakening though, Pog. Uh If it's light, a cave isn't scary. If you're strong, Pokemon aren't scary. Pretty, pretty reasonable, understandable. Hello, Ray, with your picks. Oh. Too bad we're gonna have to knock you out real fast. Not in one shot, though. <gasps> Ember. Help. Oh, pathetic. Pathetic damage. We're too bulky. We're too bulky. What does it matter to us? Take that, Ray, you pussy. Flash! No! Alright. And we're on Route 33 now. And with that, I'm going to end today's episode right there. So if you guys enjoyed today's episode, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And hit the bell so you're always notified when I upload. Tell your friends and family about me. And as always, I will see you all in the next one. Peace.